Hello there, I am Giant Gorilla from my Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we got here to Leverage Town, we got an egg, we got the charcoal, put it as a held item for Blaine, we got through the whole Mount Chimney Team Magma Team Aqua situation, and we went through the Jagged Pass too. That's pretty much what I did. And we thought we could return the meteorite back to the um, Cosmo guy, the scientist guy, but he wasn't there when we went back, we went back to Meteor Falls, so I don't know. I'll have to, I'll, I might have to do something with that later. Or maybe like in Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire, you don't really have to give back the meteorite or anything. I don't know. We'll see. So let's go into the Pokemon Gym. We're gonna take on the gym today. Finally, the gym leader. Let's talk to the rest giver. Hey, how's it going, Chimpin Brown Grotal? Leverage, Leverage's gym leader, Flannery, uses fire type Pokemon. Her passion for Pokemon burns stronger and hotter than a volcano. Don't get too close to her, you'll burn. Hose her down with water and then go for it. So we're gonna take like a little water fire fire truck hose and water that hot flannery down because apparently a lot of people think she's the hottest gym leader in Hoenn and stuff like that. It's kind of weird. I don't know what I'm talking about now. I have Prime up front. So let's take on a battle. I think the first battle's right here. Or not right here. Um, no, it might be down here. Or am I wrong? I, I, I haven't had any practice with this puzzle, so I'm going to have to do trial and error. Hmm, interesting. I don't know where to go. There's Flannery, by the way. Okay, I guess we'll start with this battle. You're a hiker, dude. Hiker, hiker, hiker. No more, huh? Oh, we that thing off its face. There we go, nice. I think we may have already skipped the first battle, but it's okay. We may have, we may have not. Here's our second battle. Kendall or Jace? It's Bubble Beam that Slugma. Get a taste of my Bubble Beam. Ha ha ha. I like it. There goes the Slugma. Level 28, yay. Okay, now that my Prime is level 28, I'm gonna switch to, um, I'm gonna switch to Peter. Hmm, I'm not sure. Okay, here's a battle. I think this is a double battle. Yep, this is a double battle. Can your Pokemon stand at 392 degree heat? I don't think so, but we're magically still alive. We're all still okay. Kekleon and Numble, huh? Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I guess it. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use Wing Attack on the Kekleon, then I'll make it a Flying type, then I'll use Shockwave, and then I'll use Bubble Beam for the Numble. That's talking about that's talking about strategy right there. Can use a faint attack. Ow, critical hit. Shockwave, I guess. And let's take you down with a tackle. There we go, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for the $18.40, man. Okay, let me go back, though, for a second. Oh, that's... okay. I want to see in that first room, though, if I, get, I missed anything. Because I'm pretty sure there's a battle in the first room. No, I'm solving the puzzle. I don't want to solve the puzzle. Not yet. Here's a battle. 
Again, Peter's up front, so we'll see what this guy has. He probably has like a slugma and an animal. A slugma and an animal. Or maybe two slugmas, I don't know. A lot of gun attack. Okay, two slugmas. Nice. Water well, gun that thing off his face. Okay, that's okay. Okay, that's like the last day battle, probably the first guy, depending on how you do it. Okay, I think I know how. I'll... some more battles I guess another Kindle huh yep pretty much the same Kindle trainer type because here's a water gun and this number is four times effective because number was fire and ground so it's four times with the water I think I know what to do now. After that, you want to go right here. And then go right here. Oh, well. That's a bummer. Hmm. Fine, we'll go right here then. Okay, I'm, I'm, this is a bunch of trial and error, so I apologize for me just going everywhere. <laughs> Go right here. Here's another battle. Yeah, yeah, we're talking about heat. The heat is on, guys. The heat is on. You have a slugma, nice. She's water gun on that thing. That's all she wrote. I didn't even know, I didn't even catch how many punch money he gave me. Now I think this bottom diagonal one you don't want to go into. It's another battle. A oh, battle girl. First we see a hiker in the stream and now we see a battle girl. Nice. Oh, that's awesome. I have wing attack. Haha. <laughs> wing attack that thing off its face. Okay, it's gonna use bide. Fair enough, fair enough. There goes that my type. Of 28, yay. We can switch back to Prime now. Okay, go right here, I think. Yeah, that's what you want. Cause if you land somewhere like right here, and and um the 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 right in front of me of my character, you'll probably land like somewhere like that. Which one? There's two options. Let's go to this one. Wait, I think that's I think this is the right way. So let me go right here real quick, to the other one. Hmm, this is hard. Let's go to this one. No, I messed it up. I chose the wrong one. I chose the wrong one. No! Ay ay ay. This is so freaking confusing.
Ay, ay, ay. Let's try this one. I think I know. Okay, I don't think there's any more trainers left. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, I think I know where to go now. I finally figured it out. Oh, at least I hope so. So if you take the route I'm taking, you should make it to the gym later. So just keep on going the way I'm going, and you'll hopefully find the gym later. Or get to the gym later. You know what? You know how, where to find her. She's in the gym, of course. Okay, and you go to this one, and then pick the one on the right, not the left. And go right here. Don't over jump it, because then you'll not land right there. But here's Flannery, the fourth gym leader of Hoenn. Here's your fire type Pokemon. Let's talk to her. Wait, first of all, I want to make sure I have Prime up front. Okay, good, I do have Prime up front, because they're real strategy. Welcome, no wits. Puny Train, how good to see you've made it here. I have been entrusted with, uh, no wait, I am friendly, and I'm the gym leader here. Uh, dare not just underestimate me though, I've been a gym leader only a short time. With skills inherited by my grandfather, I shall, uh, demonstrate the hot moves we have honed on this land. Nice to know. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna start a roll combo. Hopefully it goes well. Well, I could have just used Water Bubble Beam on this first number first, but that's okay. Okay, that failed. Okay, fine. Okay, it's gonna slowly wither down my health. Let's just knock this thing out with a Bubble Beam. There we go, nice. There goes the normal. Slugma. Okay, this is where the real fun begins. Let's try Roar Combo now. Because I think Slugma's on my pure fire right now. But when it was in the Makargo, it's a fire rock type. Which, is, which sucks because it's, you know, it has bad stats and it's weak. It's four times weak to ground and water. So that's why I don't recommend a, a Slugma. Because. No! Smog just had the poison me. You gotta be kidding me, Smalls. You're killing me, Smalls. It's all or nothing, then I can't even heal up. It's just automatic. To heal up, I have to miss. Camera up, okay. Gonna just tackle on me. I'll take it. Man, come on, it was that close to fainting it, but it wasn't enough. I hate this scenario. Sunny day makes it all bright. Okay, if, if Prime can hit this thing one last time before it dies. Wow, okay. It's gonna die of poison though. I'm just gonna die of poison, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I don't think we- I think we all ran out anyway. Time is gonna die. I knew it. Oh well. It's okay. This Torkoal's gonna be annoying. Gosh, didn't do much thing. Okay, this is why I got the red flute. It's because they attract. Guess what? My Peter will not be in love with your toy for that long, Flannery. I can tell you that. Let's go to bag. Red flute. And boom. Body slam, huh? Oh yeah, sunlight, um, 
gets boost fire type moves because of sunlight, but also decreases the power for water type moves. So, let me attack, I guess. Okay, this is going nowhere. I'm switching out. <laughs> Let's see here, what Pokemon can I switch out to? Let's give Blaine a shot. The sunlight got bright, way to go. Oh, that raises my fire type moves, even though it's not gonna be do me with anything good. Double kick. Cut. Yeah, I'll take it. This is a slow battle, but we'll get over it. We'll get through it, guys. Overheat. Okay, we'll see how much damage it does on me. It, it's not very effective, but it killed me. It's not, well, overheat's really powerful, especially with a sunny day up. And a citrus berry. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, it restores status. Okay. Um. Let's go for night. <laughs> I think night can take this thing down. And by take down, I mean take down. You're gonna heal, aren't you? Of course you're gonna heal. Of course you're gonna heal, Torgle. Of course I'm gonna miss. Of course the sunlight is strong. Okay, come on, come on. See, this is ridiculous. Well, what have I done? What have I done? What have I done, guys? Ah, man, this is just going for- this is taking a turn for the worse. The sun only faded just in case, like it just good okay, water gun that thing off its face. It's gonna attract me again. But you see, I have the red fruit regardless, so why even try to attract me? But I like wasting your turn for no point, no reason, so that's good. Oh uh, no, my sunny sunny days up again. Oh well. Yes, 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 we all know the sunlight's strong. It is strong. Critical hit, nice. Let me guess you're gonna heal again using another hyper potion flannery? Maybe, maybe not, we'll just have to see. Oh my gosh, you paralyzed me, come on. This is so not fair. There we go, okay, you don't heal. Okay, there goes the toy call. Exactly a thousand experience points, that's nice. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. I've I've only recently become a gym leader. I tried too hard to be someone's I'm not. I have to do things my natural way. If I don't, my Pokemon will be confused. Thanks thanks for teaching me that. For that you deserve this. Thanks for the twenty nine dollars. The heat badge from Flannery. Yeah, all the Pokemon level 50 and above can obey you, even traded ones, yay. TM50 over heat. I don't know if I'm gonna teach it to my uh, boy or not. I might, I might not. We'll see. Just have to put think and thought into that. Yeah. Can you strength that side about? Cool. So there's that. Yeah, oh, that was a scorching hot battle. Reverse gym, for an assisted girdle. Okay, I'm the only person who beat the gym, apparently. Oh, look, it's May. Girdle, long time no see. Oh, while I visited the hot springs, you got the lavender gym badge. You must have collected good Pokemon. No, I believe you raised them. Uh, I guess it's okay if we'd have this. The Goo Goo Goggles, which helps you get through the desert route, which we're gonna cover in the next part. So, yeah. 
Nice. Now I'm gonna challenge the public gym. I'm gonna heal up real quick. Well, actually, this has been my Pokemon um, Emerald walkthrough part. The next part, we'll go to the desert route. Yeah. And, yeah. So, we're gonna do that. And, mm, yeah, that's about it. So, this has been John Gogan. I like the video again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Emerald walkthrough guide.